Last year, crops under North Okanagan were two weeks behind. The year before that, they were two weeks ahead. But this year, they're coming in pretty much on time. Uh, this year we had a fantastic May, a great start for the vegetables and the apples. The fruit size uh, looks great. Um, the, you know, in June, the temperatures really cooled down, uh, which is uh, not really common and a lot of rain, but uh, the apples don't really mind that. It's not a huge deal for them. They, there's no stress on the trees, so they're just growing and doing their thing. Uh, the vegetables, on the other hand, they just kind of sat there and just kind of waited for, for some warmer weather. So we're happy to see the sun out again, that's for sure. Such a good start in May, uh, and uh, we took a bit of a risk putting them in the ground uh, basically as soon as we could there. And uh, that's paid off now for sure because uh, things probably still better than last year for sure. Uh, last year was a, was a late one and a cold one. Uh, but uh, we're definitely on par for normal. Or We're probably, like historically, we're probably about right in the right in the norm, I would say. Um, it looked like we were going to be pretty early, but now it's kind of even back out. So instead of a few days uh, early, I think we're probably set to be about, about normal, whatever that might be. Okay. So. For Castnet News, I'm Darren Hanchu, waiting for the harvest in Vernon.